Might I ask why your office reached out to chat with us today? You know, I think it's important is uh, we received this report after the last several months to really put it in perspective of what was at the basis of this, and that is to uh, honor then the request from an employee to keep a, a workplace uh, situation um, confidential. Uh, the report will, the vast majority of the report shows that we took action on those, uh, those issues facing us, um, that uh, no uh, uh, formal complaint was filed, um, that that is what is at the core in making sure that we honor our employees and have a safe place for them to work. So you, your office did not downplay a sexual harassment claim against a high-ranking official. The issue in front of us was there was no uh, formal complaint. We acted on um, an employee's request for confidentiality. Anything any private employer would do that you would not want it all over the place. And so that is uh, exactly what we did. Um, it was not substantiated. There was uh, the uh, the person requested that it not be investigated. That not enough over and over again asked us not to. But did uh, we did have some indication of uh, difficulty? work environment and so we took action and we reviewed those uh, those and took action for those employees so it, a lot of this surrounds obviously um, the former police chief Frank Straub who was hand selected by you well, actually, you know, we went through a similar process uh, last time. Five different citizen panels interviewed our police chief. Four of them selected Frank Straub. The city council confirmed uh, Mr. Straub. And so the, uh, a lot of the uh, talking points by the media and others that say he was handpicked, uh, by our process, the police chief is nominated by the mayor, confirmed by the city council. And that was a very open and transparent process last time. All of the uh, vetting sheets uh, that were used during that, those interviews, uh, the public can get and the vast majority four out of five uh, selected excuse me f uh, three out of five selected Frank Straub one went with our other uh, contender and one uh, went with nobody and so we find ourselves similarly this time with a huge robust um, interview process for our next police chief this time four panels in a public forum um, I'm reviewing all that data now but again a very open process but yes the police chief is um, nominated by uh, the mayor and then confirmed by the council do people have anything to worry about with the the next police chief the finalist where we are I mean we we know that um, the city council now wants other candidates well you know I think what's uh, critical is our community stands behind our police chief uh, that was uh, the process that we've been in now has been many months in the making um, uh, dozens of people involved in interviewing public forums I've received a lot of public uh, feedback I'm reviewing that right now and again I will make the nomination and the City Council will confirm um, the our next police chief but you know at the core of this is we need to respect our employees all throughout the system um, from a uh, front line all the way through senior staff and that's how we rebuild the trust um, we have had a setback uh, but at the core of this is the report identified some mistakes identified uh, steps that we need to take uh, going forward and we're already starting on those now okay there are calls for your resignation we're gonna you get to stay with us this morning which we are thrilled about so in another half an hour when we come back with the mayor will really talk about what that means. Um, thank you for being here. He's going to go pop on and talk with Christy over on News Radio 920 right now.